Hi, and welcome to the Kelly Lumber podcast, where we have a new format. Every month, I'm going to be sharing with you two value-led podcast episodes where you can learn a little bit more about personal branding or something that I'm doing in my business that can help you. And this week, I thought it would be really useful to talk about launching a program. So when it comes to personal branding, there is only one of you, but how can you elevate but also accelerate the leverage of your personal brand when it comes to monetizing it? And one of the ways that I found to do that really well is by launching a group mentoring program, a group coaching program. So if this is an industry that you're in, then listen to the rest of this episode. So this week, I just launched Brand You Accelerator for the last time in 2023. I'm really excited because I've launched it a couple of times already and every launch gets better and better. So I wanted to share with you the things that I've been doing to launch this specific program and why a group coaching or a mentoring program will work really well for you. Because I know it's something that when I've spoken to clients in the past that they get a little bit nervous about and I'm going to be telling you what they get nervous about and how to overcome it. Why I like group programs so well, don't get me wrong, one-to-one, I love the attention to detail. I love being able to support people on a really personalized journey. But when there is only one of you and you've got more people you want to help and support, then this is a great way to do this. So what you're bringing together is a community of like-minded individuals who want to work together within your niche. So for me, it's personal branding. Our 90 day program is really focused on accelerating the growth of your personal brand strategy and getting some really clear results. When it comes to you thinking about launching your program or something that you're doing, you need to get really clear on the timeline. When do you think people can actually get visible results? That's all going to count as part of your testimonials. It's all going to count as some of your results that you're going to get. For me, I feel that I've found 90 days, that is three months, 12 weeks to be the sweet spot. I've tried six months and I've tried 12 months. And I can tell you, this is the one that works really well for me. Identify, first of all, how long it's going to be and what works well for you to get results. What am I including in those 12 weeks? And you can think about how you're going to map it out for you. Well, in Brand You Accelerator, what we are offering is the first one to two weeks, really the foundations of your personal brand, the essence of your personal brand, the impact. It's all about defining, you know, what makes you different and how do you stand out? Because this is going to be how people relate to you. So you need to be thinking about what can you include in the foundations of your group coaching or your group mentoring program? Week three and four for me is all about amplifying your online presence. So this is huge when it comes to personal brand because it is all about credibility and visibility and about being seen. So how do you do this? And what I'm looking for results for clients is to increase a bit of their visibility during those 12 weeks. So what's one thing in your coaching and mentoring program that you could include where there would be some defining results that people can get? Look at tried and tested methods that you've implemented in your business or to get results? And then how can clients implement that into their business? Week five and six is all about mastering storytelling. So when it comes to your personal branding, storytelling is really key. And again, this is where the relatability factor comes in and people just resonate much more with stories than they do facts. So there's some really easy skills that you can learn and practice. And this is again, something that is achievable for clients to do within 12 weeks. Week seven and eight is all about getting clarity on speaking opportunities and getting paid to speak. Now, there's a couple of ways that you can actually get paid to speak. It might be a fee or it can be speak for free, but it, then you actually upsell your product. And sometimes you can actually make more by doing that. So that's something within the program and Brand You Accelerator we're really working towards as well. Week nine and 10, this is all about building multiple 
revenue stream. So at this point, when it comes to your personal brand, you've got a good understanding as to, you know, what is your personal brand? What makes you different from everyone else? You've highlighted opportunities to speak, media opportunities, potentially a better social media strategy for your personal brand. How else can you be monetizing your personal brand? What are you missing out on? What money are you lying on the table that could be an easy win for you? Or what I like to say, sort of low hanging fruit. And this is all about developing a personalized, monetized roadmap. So what could you personalize for your clients that gives them the roadmap that they really need to have if they want to get results quite quickly? 11 and 12 is really all about elevating your personal brand to the next level. So what are some of the things that you can be doing to stand out? So where in your program can you be thinking, okay, this is next level. These are things that people are not thinking about, but they should be thinking about because this is where they get the results. It's also really important to highlight what are some of the program benefits? Why should someone come to you? Why are the results going to be different for you? Or if they come to you, why are the results going to be different rather than going to your competitors? So for me, I'm all about understanding that clients, when they're working with me, I've gone through the process myself, building my own personal brand strategies that have worked that haven't. And again, that comes to the storytelling aspect, but also what's worked for your clients. Maybe not everyone will relate to every story that you share personally, but they might relate to a client story or a win that's happened for one of your clients. So it's really important to share what are the program benefits that they're going to get. Now, the crucial parts here that you want to be thinking about when you're launching a group setup is I believe that you need to put some limitations in this. So what are some of the limitations that I've put in? First of all, I've said there's only 20 places. So it's scarce. It's not available to everyone. You have to apply now and there's just 20 places available. Also, I've put a timeline on it. So there's two timelines. Of course, this is not open all year round. It opens only three times a year. So this is the chance that clients can get the opportunity before the end of the year and get their personal brand strategy in place before the new year. That's a great hook to have, but also I've got an early bird offer. So for those that are interested in joining and for those action takers, I always love working with action takers, but those that take action early, they get so many benefits. So benefits can include, for you, can be very different. You could collaborate with other people, but things like a one-to-one session as a bonus. I'm also offering collateral, so LinkedIn banners, a bio, social media graphics that can help launch their personal brand? What's something that you can include, whether it's a collaboration or something that you've already created that you can add into the program to add value? Add value and do it within a time frame as well is a huge draw as to closing clients because if they know that they can always join, then often they don't. But if they have a little bit of urgency in when they can join, It's a really good tip for you when it comes to launching a program when it's in a group setup. A couple of different aspects for you and for your clients, because these are maybe support you with some ideas when it comes to, oh, well, I want one to one, but I can only afford group, for example. So here's some benefits for your clients when it comes to why should they join a group setup and not have one to one. I mentioned they are cost effective. You know, group programs can often be more affordable for clients because you're in a group setting. So you're leveraging your time as well and it makes it accessible to a wider audience. Something that I've seen when I've done group programs is peer support. So the aspect of peer support is there's other people going through the same thing at the same time of you. It might not be exactly the same, but it can be similar. So that peer support and encouragement makes you feel like you're not alone. And especially when you own your own business, it can be quite an isolating experience. You're doing what you love, but you don't always have people to speak to. So in this situation and scenario, it can work really, really well. Accountability. I love this. Accountability when not only you've got a mentor who's looking for you to come back with, have you done this, but also also, you've said what you're going to do. It's certainly how I run it in my programs is you share each week, what are you going to be held accountable for? And then you show up next week saying, I've done this, or I learned this, or this was the outcome. So that perspective is 
it drives huge results in being accountable. You've got diverse perspectives. So sometimes you'll find in group programs, maybe not everyone's doing exactly the same as you, but they come up with an idea for their business and you think, oh, I could do that in mine. And and I found this happen so many times. And I remember the last program that I did, there was one client in a very niche industry, but he implemented so much and it gave so many ideas to other clients that were in completely different businesses. So it's a real diverse perspective that helps you also grow in your business, not doing the same thing as everyone else in your industry and learning from others has huge benefits. There's also structured learning. So when you're in a group setting, you'll tend to find that is a little bit more structured and some people enjoy structured setup rather than, okay, today I need to come up with this challenge and this is what I need some help with. So if you're going through a space where a client likes their formality and knowing what they're doing week from week, this can be a really good suggestion for them. And then of course you have motivation and um, inspiration. Being part of a group is hugely motivating and inspiring when you learn from other people and you just see what others are up to and so much can come from that. So there are some benefits from a client's perspectives. What about if you're thinking about from your perspective? Well, the leveraged aspects when it comes to growing your business and you're not just trading time for money because you're actually doing it in a scalable setting. That I think has got to be a huge benefit and one where you can really monetize your personal brand. What are some of the benefits for you building a leveraged business model when it comes to launching a group program or mentoring? Well, first of all, you've got multiple revenue streams. So this could just be one program and you could have multiple group programs. And again, when you're reaching a wider audience, you have a regular retainer income coming in. It's a huge opportunity for you to scale your business just being one person. You've got the leverage on your time, but not just that, increased brand exposure. So you've got the brand exposure where more people are seeing you, more people are getting results, more people can write testimonials. There's so much growth opportunity in that, which helps with visibility and then in turn bringing in more clients as well. I love this one. You're building a community, a community of like-minded people that can learn from each other, can add so much more. Maybe not everyone's ready to buy into your program today, but the more you build on that community, the more people talk about it, the more that you will have people for the next launch. I think one of the biggest mistakes that people do make is that they launch one program and they maybe only get two or three people on it and then they go, that didn't work. And the best programs launch multiple times tweaking a tiny thing, what worked, what didn't work. So for me and my programs I've learned in business that the six months didn't work, the 12 months didn't work, but the 12 weeks, the three months does work. But when it comes to my messaging, when it comes to what am I including, all of that is still the same. So you just get better and better every time. And that comes down to as well, feedback an improvement. So always asking, what did you like about that? What could I do better on? And just keep honing in on that product and service is only going to make what you offer much, much better. So that was a solo episode on the Kelly Lundberg podcast, all about Brand New Accelerator, our new program, which has just launched. This is the last time it's going to be available in 2023. So if you're looking to elevate your personal brand, the time is now. And also this is an opportunity for you to learn about building a group program. How can you leverage? In what I do, I share everything with my clients in terms of how it works, what didn't work. This is your chance to learn what works in this group program and how you can do the same. Thanks for tuning in. Until next time. Bye for now.